Evo Morales has been president of Bolivia since January 2006. But he says his work is not done. The poor, indigenous people, women, still need him, still want him. Mission completed. We're ready to run again. This is not up for debate. The people voted in a referendum in February 2016 against allowing continuous re-election. President Morales initially accepted that result, but then urged the Constitutional Court to overturn it. His popularity has waned in recent years. However, Bolivia's economy is growing, and he still has plenty of admirers. For everything he has managed to achieve, we are very thankful to our president. If it were possible, I'd like him to be president for another 50 years. There's no one else like him. If Evo Morales wins in 2019, he'll be president until 2025, a total of 19 years in office. These people believe that you can't have too much of a good thing. The president Evo Morales, at a relatively young 58 years old, still has plenty to give Bolivia. Others, however, believe that power has corrupted him, that he's abused the constitution and that he should go. The opposition, which has been fragmented, argumentative, is now increasingly united against what they see as a challenge to Bolivia's democracy. Samuel Doria Medina finished a distant second to Evo Morales in the 2014 presidential elections. Because this kind of government, the populism, in Venezuela and in Cuba, in Bolivia, they use democracy when they will win. But uh, when, they will, when they will lose an election, they don't want the elections. So that's the problem. And with elections still two years away, it's a problem many believe is only likely to grow. There's no confidence in the state. They've weakened and in many cases destroyed the institutions that are fundamental for the existence of democracy. So in the next two years, society will be very polarized. And what's worse, it'll be on the streets where it's decided who will win power. With all of Bolivia's key institutions under his control, it's a dilemma, a potential crisis that only Evo Morales can resolve. Daniel Schweimler, Al Jazeera, Cochabamba, Bolivia.